how far would you go for the love of your pet? In the latest episode of The Dig, CBS 2's Elle McLogan finds an unusual business for people who share a special bond with their pets. In Manhattan's West Village, there's an artist who paints portraits of pets. My name is Mimi Van Olsen, and my profession is a pet portrait painter. Mostly dogs and cats, but uh, occasionally guinea pigs or a bird. I don't paint animals after they pass away. I like to beat them. I see their true personalities. They do their act for me. I think that's the only rule, is get it right, you know, so that it's absolutely that pet, and not just any corgi. Right. Yeah, it's this corgi. A fun part of this job is uh, my first introduction to the pets speed cat or dog when I go into the house or the apartment I gasp when I when I see what the pets are doing oh is it cute this is Sam Sam what gorgeous mark sometimes the dogs jump up on you the cats just stay in their place or they run behind me and refrigerate <laughs> you never know oh it's beautiful I'm gonna get a close up it's not only fun but it, it serves a purpose it serves a small need for a small bunch of people <laughs> how do you hope people feel when they see the final unveiling I would like them to get and say, oh my God, it's exactly like the pet. Exactly <laughs> like my Rocky or my this or my that, whatever. Uh, it should be a wonderful surprise and they should think that that's the best portrait I've ever done. It takes Mimi about a month to complete a single pet portrait and one portrait can cost in the thousands of mm. dollars. She's good. She's good. She's worth very it. good. Yeah. yeah, I'd say so. And her fans love her. What happens is people walk by, they see the shop, which is actually how I first found Mimi. Mm -hmm. I walked by and I saw in the window pet portraits. I yeah. thought I had, I had to go in. <laughs> I must go in. And there's people, your cat right there. Yeah. No. <laughs> nice fish. All I need is a pet, and then <laughs> yeah. I can commission my pet portrait. Um, but you, different customers will come in. They'll they'll talk to her about what they want to get included, and the more detail and the yeah, more pets you'd like say, to include. Like, how, how does she determine? Price. Like I saw the. Cat Cat had a fish, you know, right there as yeah. <laughs> right. sort of his meal. Right. But you know, I wonder, you know, is there so there's discussion about what else to include as far as the setting goes. Mm -hmm. the well, that was actually a, that was a portrait of the pet fish. They just had a cat in it. <laughs> <laughs> Could have been both. The I don't know. The, the fish part, didn't look alive. <laughs> <laughs> the attention to detail, though. I mean, she's she's a talented woman. Did she, did she do humans as well, or just pets? She actually began with humans. Humans were, were part of her repertoire okay. until she realized yep. just how fun it can be to yeah. paint pets. And the demand was there. I mean, in the West Village area, everyone's mm. walking by with their pets, and and she's she's got her audience. Well, it's an investment. It is, but it's a, it lasts a lifetime. Yeah, and the pets are alive that she that she paints. Do they mm -hmm. react to it when she brings it to their home? Do they're like, wait, that's me. <laughs> I wonder if they can recognize themselves. Wait a second, that's me. Weird, no. <laughs> I wonder if I'm going anywhere. <laughs> you know, how, like when they look in a mirror. <laughs> right. <freak> exactly. <laughs> I was I was with her when she first met yeah. the, the pets, mm -hmm. and they definitely you know show her her personality, and she right. captures that in, her, in the final painting. Thank awesome. you, Al. Thank you, you always find those gems. Well, for Al's full episode and to check out all of the videos that she's done, go to our 24-hour streaming service, CBSN New York, or CBSNewYork.com/slash/thedig.